Hey YouTube, it's Will Shea here tonight with a discussion video. But before I start the video, if any of you subscribe, or any of those people that just subscribed to me, you guys are entering my contest, um, please do what the rule says, because I need to know if you're actually entering the contest or not, or you're just subscribing because you like my videos. But anyways, um, for this discussion video, I'll be talking about side deck cards for the Duels Alliance. There's no way having getting Yon Zines, the Tower Knights, Shadows and we're getting um what else? Burning Abyss. Mm. I think that's pretty much all the good stuff. But for the first card we have come on. For the first card we have Dimension Fortress Weapon. He's a low four, seventeen hundred attack, two hundred defense. So cars cannot be sent from the deck to the grave. So if this basically shuts down the so Tower Knights and Shadows, because if someone just Shadows effects it requires you to send Shadows from your deck to the graveyard. And coming most of the Shadows, Shadows um, effects go off when uh, it's sent to the grave by a card effect. Um, so this basically shuts them down and makes them stop, you know, sending cards from the deck to the grave. And it about stops this Tower Knight. Um, I think it stops some Dolce's too. And coin just stops down Foolish Burial, which is case if you're facing someone that uses, that uses Foolish Burial in Shadows or whatever, and they still cannot send cards when they die to the grave. Uh, the second monster is Fossil Dino. Um, there's going to be a lot of special summoning uh, for the decks and Duels Alliance. Um, even before you can special summon monsters. When this card's flip face up, destroy all special summon monsters. So basically, nukes Shadow's card, Satora Knights. Oh, I guess the Tower Knights, but I don't really think Satora Knights are going to have a lot of special summoning. But Yonzines, Yonzines will have a lot of special summoning because they're effects and going to be synchro summoning a lot. And currently, Burning Abyss is going to have a, um, a lot of special summoning. This is pretty good. Um. For spells, you have no man cross it out. This is good against the dolls because the dolls have flip effects. And with this, you can target a face down card. Its effect cannot be activated and it's destroyed. Oh no, it's removed from play, sorry. And if it was a flipped effect, um, both players check their deck and then send, remove all monsters of the same name from play, then shuffle the decks. So basically, if you're facing your dolls, um, it still doesn't get the effect, but you know, your opponent still has to show it. If it was a flip effect monster, both players check their deck, and if you're not pointing your dolls, you're fine, but he has to check his deck and remove from play the, the monster of the same name. For the Nara spell, Sorries, is going to be pretty good against um, Yanzines, uh, Satellar Knights, and I guess Burning Abyss too. I guess Burning Abyss do have that trap card, like a special summon back as many. Um, so it's pretty good too. And it, I know I'm a Light Sworn player, but it's good against Light Sworns too. Um, final card is Defusion. Defusion is going to be. Very popular this format, I believe, because of Shadows and I think Heroes are supposed to come back to this format. I'm not sure. But I heard something about Heroes probably coming back to the um to the game competitively. Um this space we shut down Shadows. Um and going to this uh, a lot of people are having problems with deep fusion because no one's been using it for millennia. So yeah, with deep fusion your opponent fusion summons, you can activate this. That fusion goes to the extra deck, well, goes back to the extra deck, and but since you use it against your opponent's fusion, they don't get the materials back because it says it needs the materials need to be in your grave. So your opponent won't be able to send them back to materials, but the fusion monster he control goes back to the extra. For the next trap, for the traps, you have rivalry of war words, pretty good against the Zings because the Zings um have a lot of attributes. And um, and they go and control one type of monster, and when it goes and matches 
going to be pretty good to you. And this will be good against, uh, I believe, I, I think just Yondine, because Yondine have a lot of attributes. Second, Coffin Stiller. Coffin Stiller is pretty good to you against Shadows and Satoru Knights, I guess. Because, you know, each time a monster is sent to your opponent's graveyard and flip running damage to your opponent. So, yeah, it's basically pretty good to deal damage to your opponent when, because, you know, a lot of the Shadows require sending their card to the grave, their own kind. And they're saying that show all monsters to the grave. And it's pretty good. Not bad. Um, this trap's never been played before, but I actually found a pretty good way. Uh, loyal Prison. Monsters cannot be special owned from the grave. So this basically stops any, you know, card that special summons from the graveyard. Soul Charge. Shadow Falcon. Um, Cho Win. The late Yanjing Tuner. So yeah, Royal Prison stops a lot of special summoning from the grave, so it basically shuts down Shadows, Yanjings, Satellar Knights, Soul Charge, of course. So pretty good. Um, Needle Ceiling. Um, like I said, there's going to be a lot of special summoning in this format. Uh, a lot more summoning, so there's four more monsters, destroy all face up monsters at the field. Now, Transmigration Break, I kind of just noticed this card laying around my room. So, any cards that we've returned from the deck to the grave are removed from play instead. So, basically, good against Mandolces, because Mandolces do have those two cards, two spells. Any card sent to the any Mandolce returned to the deck is um, get, having to get to add one. So this basically shuts down with Dolce's because any card that will be turned to the deck is from the grave or removed from play instead. So they won't get those two Dolce spells um, effects off. Um, so it says probability 0%. Um, pretty good against Dolce's because it's like two random fusions from their extra, from their extra deck and sound to the grave. And fine for the last card is pretty good against Medolces. And not Medolce, sorry. Shadows, it really pisses him off. I've been testing on doing at work and <laughs> I get rage quits um, against my opponents when I use it. And that's Miss Polymerization. Miss Polymerization <laughs> yeah, really pisses off the, the Shadow players. Yeah, it's when a fusion monster is special summon, um, including meaning fusion summon to you, return all phase of fusions on the field to the respective fusion decks. Well, this is old school, so I mean, and today Yu Gi Oh is its extra deck. So, so let's say your opponent um, is using your dolls or heroes, you have tons of fusions on the field, they fusion someone, another fusion, you play this, and all their fusions go back to the extra deck. So, it really makes them mad. <laughs> Pretty, this will be good against Shadows. Yeah, all these cards I talked about, guys, are going to be pretty good for side decking. I highly recommend you use them. Um, including Transmigration Break against, you know, Shadows. Deep Fusion, you know. All these good cards I talked about are going to be pretty good in this format. Um, well, according to Dualist Alliance decks, too. Yeah, so, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Um, I just want to talk about, you know, good side deck cards for this, um, for Shadows, Yonzines, uh, Burning Abyss, um, Satoru Knights. So, yeah, a lot of these cards are, will be good against them. I think the most good card I chose is going to be Royal Prison, because, you know, Royal Prison stops special summon from the grave. And a lot of the cards that are coming out are, do you require special summon from the grave? Equivalent is it to Tower Knight and the Shadows. This to shut down Medolces. This is shut down Yanzines. Shut shutting Pezzi and Hero and um, Shadow players off. Nuking fields. Stopping Shadow players again. Um, White Swarms or. Um, Yanzines, Shadows, Shadows, 
to tell you it's Yanjing because you know Yanjing require a lot of special summoning and finally should always and I guess you could say it's a Tower Knights to you. So yeah guys, that's pretty much it. Remember to like and subscribe. Comment down below if you guys like this video. And let me know what you guys think. So yeah, these are pretty good side deck cards for the upcoming Duels Alliance decks. Um, they're supposed to be tier decks. So yeah, remember to like and subscribe. And this is Yusei Duels J signing off. Peace.